You're Drifting Off with WSLP AM, Big Rapids. Tonight, from Foghorn Field in Cadillac, Michigan, it's the Cadillac Cars, hosting the Toma Tigers of Toma, Wisconsin. And now your host, Wally McCarthy. Good evening, friends. Wally McCarthy here with producer Phil alongside. Tonight we are back at beautiful Foghorn Field in Cadillac, Michigan, as the Cadillac Cars host the Toma Tigers of Toma, Wisconsin. It is a perfect night for a ball game. 76 degrees at game time, and just a gentle breeze blowing out. Let's take a peek at tonight's starting lineup for the visiting Toma Tigers. Leading off and playing second base, Vaughn Kramer. Batting second, and playing left field, Prudence Jefferson. Right fielder Bruford Kosinski will bat third. Center fielder Schmitty Diaz will bat cleanup for the Tigers. First baseman Ernesto Stern will bat fifth. Batting sixth, playing third base, Bert Sessions. Catcher Clifton Santiago will bat seventh. Batting eighth, shortstop Sharky Bush. And batting ninth, starting pitcher Todd Gonzalez. The starting pitcher for Cadillac this evening is right-hander Brock Niedermeyer. He enters tonight's game with a record of five and three and a 4.13 ERA. His battery partner is catcher Giovanni Gasparro. And defensively for Cadillac this evening, Philip Nakamura is at first base. Flipper Cortez at second. Shiny Patterson is at third base. Gilligan Parker in left field. And Parker back in the lineup after being out for 10 days. And you may notice he's clean-shaven and sporting a crew cut. Apparently, he got a little too far off the grid in the Upper Peninsula and went missing for several days. The Mounties found him dressed in a fresh deerskin trying to build a makeshift cabin. He was a bit dazed from lack of food and sleep, but he's okay. Mostly his pride was hurt. Nothing a little bed rest and a regimen of milkshakes and vitamins can't take care of. It happens to the best of us. And in center field, Fritz Ortega. And Gabriel Palomar rounds things out in right field. And producer Phil has just passed me a note. He says he does not believe they have Mounties in the Upper Peninsula. 
We'll look into that and offer a correction if needed. And crew chief B.R. Montebianco has signaled that it's time to play ball and we are underway. And Vaughn Kramer will step in to lead us off. He's batting 253 this season. And the pitch from Niedermeyer. And that's very high for ball one. The 1 0. And that's called a strike. It's 1 and 1. The 1 1 pitch. And that's a grounder up the middle. Tough play for Slauson. And Kramer will beat the throw at first. And that's a leadoff single for Vaughn Kramer. Man on first, nobody out for Prudence Jefferson. And the pitch. And that's outside for ball one. The 1-0. Foul tipped, it's one and one. The one one. Swing and a miss for strike two. That was a nice change up from Niedermeyer. The one two. And that's fouled off and out of play. We'll do it again. The pitch. Low and inside, it's two and two. The 2-2. Tapped foul will do it again. The pitch. That's a hard hit bouncer to first. Nakamura steps on the bag and fires to second. And Vaughn Kramer will be tagged out at second. And that's a 3-4 double play. Two outs. Base is empty for Bruford Kosinski. And the pitch. And that paints the corner for a called strike. 0-1. The 0-1. Chopped foul and out of play, it's 0-2. The 0-2 pitch. That's a ground ball to the left side. Patterson cuts it off and fires to first in time to end the inning. No score here at Foghorn Field in Cadillac. And we'll be back with the bottom of the first in a moment. 
here on the Northwoods Baseball Radio Network. shenanigans of the Sleep Baseball universe at sleepbaseball.com. The latest episodes, news from the Quint Cities, and fabulous items from the gift shop. Sign up for Wally's World, our infrequent and mildly entertaining newsletter. Find it all today at sleepbaseball.com. Welcome back with us at Foghorn Field in Cadillac, Michigan. Wally McCarthy here, alongside producer Phil. No score as we begin the bottom of the first inning. And Gilligan Parker will step in to face Tigers starter Todd Gonzalez. Gonzalez has a record of 4-3 and three with a 3.16 ERA. And the pitch to Parker. That's called a strike on the outside corner. The 0-1. Outside for a ball, it's one and one. The one one pitch, and that's fouled back and out of play, it's one and two. The one two. And that bounces in the dirt in front of the plate. It's two and two. The two two. Swung on and missed for the first out. And that will bring up Pinky Slauson. And the pitch. That's inside for ball one. The 1 0. Low and inside for ball two. The 2 0. Inside again, and Gonzalez falls behind 3-0. and The 3-0 pitch. That's low, and that's a four-pitch walk for Slauson. One out. Man on first for Fritz Ortega. Gonzalez will toss over to first to check on Slauson. And the pitch to Ortega. 
That's in there for a called strike. 0 and 1. Via one, and that misses outside. It's one and one. The one one, and that's in there for strike two. The one-two pitch, and that runs inside for ball two. The two-two, that's a ground ball to the right side. Kramer flips to second in time. Bush fires to first, not in time to get Ortega. Slauson is out at second for the second out of the inning. Runner on first. Two outs for Shiny Patterson. And the pitch. And that misses low for ball one. The 1-0, and that's outside for ball two. The 2-0, and that's very low, and Gonzalez falls behind 3-0. The 3-0 pitch, and that's called a strike. It's 3-1. The 3-1. Swing and a miss on that low cutter. Full count. The payoff pitch, and that's belted to left field. Jefferson is under it, and he makes the catch at the warning track for out number three. We are scoreless here in Cadillac after the first inning, and we'll be back with more baseball here on the Northwoods Baseball Radio Network.
and welcome back to Foghorn Field here in Cadillac. Wally McCarthy and producer Phil back with you. We are scoreless as we begin the second inning. And Schmitty Diaz will step in to face Brock Niedermeyer. And the pitch to Diaz. And that paints the corner for strike one. Yo one. And that's inside, it's one and one. The one one pitch. Fouled back and out of play, it's one and two. And the pitch. And that's popped into center field. Ortega is there. And he has it for out number one. One out. Nobody on for Ernesto Stern. And the pitch. And that one runs high for ball one. The 1 0. -oh. Inside for ball two. The 2 0 -oh pitch. And that one's called a strike. It's two and one. The two one pitch. And that one misses low for ball three. The three one pitch. And that's low again for ball four, and Stern will trot down to first. One out, runner on first for Burt Sessions. And the pitch, and that's low for ball one. The 1 0. And that's chopped to the left side. Patterson scoops it up and fires the second in time. Cortez to first, but no chance to get Sessions there. Stern is retired at second for the second out, and Sessions is on first. And that will bring up catcher Clifton Santiago. And the pitch. And that misses upstairs, ball one. The 1 0. -oh. That's a curveball in there for strike one. The 1-1, one, one. and Santiago lays down a bunt, perfectly executed for a bunt single. Two on, two outs for Sharky Bush.
and the pitch. And that's low for ball one. The 1 0. And that's in there for a strike. It's 1 and 1. The 1 1 pitch. And that misses outside for ball two. The 2 1. And that's high for ball three, and Niedermeyer falls behind three and one. And the pitch. And that's outside for ball four. That's the second walk handed out by Niedermeyer this inning. Bases loaded. Two outs for the pitcher's spot, Todd Gonzalez. And the pitch. And that's dribbled right back to Niedermeyer, who tosses to first in time to end the inning. Niedermeyer gets out of a bases-loaded jam. And we are still scoreless here in Cadillac. We'll be back with the bottom of the second in a moment here on the Northwoods Baseball Radio Network. This is Giovanni Gasparo. When I was a kid, we did all kinds of crazy things, like a stand on our heads and eat a cracker. Later, some of my friends turned to their drugs, and all kinds of things happened to them. This has been Giovanni Gasparo with the PSA for WSLP. And welcome back with us here in Cadillac, Michigan at Foghorn Field. No score as we begin the bottom of the second. And Gabriel Palomar will step in to face Todd Gonzalez. And the pitch. And that misses outside for ball one. The 1 0. Swung on and missed. It's 1 and 1. The 1-1 pitch, and that's popped into center field. Diaz is there, and he makes the catch for out number one. One out, base is empty for Philip Nakamura. And the pitch. High and outside for ball one.
the 1-0. And that's lined right into the glove of Vaughn Kramer for out number two. And that will bring up Fritz Ortega. And the pitch. And that's low for ball one. The 1-0 pitch, and that's chopped up the middle. Kramer picks it up and tosses to first in time for out number three. And that's a 1-2-3 inning for Todd Gonzalez. No score between the Toma Tigers and the Cadillac Cars. We'll be back with the third inning in a moment here on the Northwoods Baseball Radio Network. shenanigans of the Sleep Baseball universe at SleepBaseball.com. The latest episodes, news from the Quint Cities, and fabulous items from the gift shop. Sign up for Wally's World, our infrequent and mildly entertaining newsletter. Find it all today at SleepBaseball.com. And welcome back to Foghorn Field here in Cadillac, Michigan. Wally McCarthy and producer Phil back with you. No score as we enter the third inning, and Vaughn Kramer will step in at the top of the Tigers' order. Kramer had a single in the first inning. And the pitch from Niedermeyer. And that's popped into center field. Ortega is camped under it. And he makes the catch for out number one. One out. Nobody on for Prudence Jefferson. The pitch. And that misses outside for ball one. The 1-0. And that's a dribbler back to Niedermeyer, and he lobs it to first in time for out number two. The pitch. And that's lined into the gap in left field. And that's going to be a two-out single for Bruford Kosinski. Two outs. One on for Schmitty Diaz. The pitch. And that's fouled back and out of play. It's 0 and 1. The 
the 0-1. And Diaz takes a wild swing at the Yacker for strike two. The pitch. And that's lifted down the line in left field. And Parker has it for out number three. Still no score here at Foghorn Field. We'll be back with more baseball here on the Northwoods Baseball Radio Network. Welcome back with us here at Foghorn Field in Cadillac, Michigan. Still no score as we begin the bottom of the third, and Giovanni Gasparo will step in to face Todd Gonzalez. And the pitch. That's called a strike. 0 and 1. The 0 1. Swing and a miss. It's 0 and 2. The 0-2 pitch, and that's fouled back, and we'll do it again. And the pitch, and that's fouled off to the right and out of play, still 0-2. the pitch. Lined foul again. Gasparo is battling out there. And the pitch. And that's in the dirt for a ball. It's one and two. The one-two. And Gasparo strikes out looking for the first out. And that will bring up the pitcher's spot, Brock Niedermeyer. And the pitch. And that's popped into left field. Kosinski is there to make the catch for out number two. And
And that's seven in a row retired by Todd Gonzalez. Two outs, nobody on for the top of the Cadillac order with Gilligan Parker. Parker struck out swinging in the first inning. And the pitch. That misses low for ball one. The 1-0. -oh. Swung on and missed. It's 1-1. One and one. The 1-1 one -one pitch. And that's outside for ball two. The 2-1, and that's chopped foul one out of play. The 2-2, swing and a miss to end the inning. And we're still scoreless through three innings here at Foghorn Field. We'll be back with more baseball here on the Northwoods Baseball Radio Network. I'm Giovanni Gasparo for Mr. King's Particles. We're the only one in the Queen City area with a helium. How else are you going to throw the balloon without a helium? That's what I say. Go over to Mr. King's Particles. Tell him that Giovanni Gasparo sent him. What a lift. Mr. King's particles. And welcome back with us here at Foghorn Field in Cadillac, Michigan. Wally McCarthy here alongside producer Phil. And we are scoreless as we enter the top of the fourth inning. And Ernesto Stern will step in. He walked in the second inning. Niedermeyer's pitch, and that's fouled back and out of play. It's 0-1. The 0-1, fouled off again, 0-2. The 0-2 pitch, fouled back, and we'll do it again. And the pitch, and that's chopped into the shift. Palomar has it and fires to first in time to retire Stern. One out. 
Nobody on for Burt Sessions. And the pitch. And that skied to shallow right. Palomar is under it. And he makes the catch for out number two. Two outs, bases empty for catcher Clifton Santiago. Santiago had a bunt single in the second. The pitch. Swung on and missed, 0-1. DL1. Another swing and a miss. It's 0 and 2. And the 0 2 pitch. And that bounces in front of the plate. Gasparo does a good job getting to it. It's 1 and 2. The one two. Down and in for a ball, it's two and two. The two two pitch. And that's fouled down the first baseline, and we'll do it again. the pitch. And that misses outside. It's a full count. The payoff pitch. And that's inside for ball four. Santiago draws a two-out walk. Runner on first, two outs for Sharky Bush. The pitch. That's in there for a called strike, 0-1. The 0-1. Fouled back, and it's 0-2. The 0-2 pitch. That misses outside. A ball and two strikes. The 1-2. Outside again, it's two and two. The two two. And that's popped up left side. Slauson comes in, and he has it for out number three. Still scoreless here at Foghorn Field. And we'll be back with the bottom of the fourth here on the Northwoods Baseball Radio Network. Hello. You know me. This is Ed, Uncle Hat. The good folks over there at Big Tom's Shoe Repair and Gelato asked me to drop by and say a few words for them. 
Father Rizza. Big Tom's been in sure care since he was knee-eyed or a locust, and his wife, whose name escapes me, has been in the gelato business for several days now. Why don't you stop by over there to Big Tom's shoe repair and gelato and get your shoes repaired? If you're like me, you've put up quite a few miles in on those shoes. And why don't you get a nice cup of pistachio while you're there? And tell Big Tom that uh, Ed Uncle Hat said hi and don't kick him. Thanks for listening. And welcome back with us here at Foghorn Field in Cadillac, Michigan. No score as we begin the bottom of the fourth, and Pinky Slauson will step in to face Todd Gonzalez. Slauson walked in the first inning. And the pitch. That's called a strike on the outside corner, 0 and 1. The 0 1. And that misses outside, it's 1 and 1. And the 1-1. One, one. Outside again, it's 2-1. And, the 2-1. And that's inside for ball three. The 3-1, and that's chopped foul down the third base line, full count. The payoff pitch, and that's popped up, shallow center, Bush is going out, and he has it for out number one. One out, nobody on for Fritz Ortega. And the pitch. And that's chopped right to the shortstop who has it and tosses to first in time for out number two. And Shiny Patterson will step in. the pitch. And that's in there for a called strike. 0-1. Oh the 0-1. Oh that's called a strike. It's 0-2. Oh And the 0-2 pitch. That's a fly ball to right field. Kosinski is there, and he makes the catch for the third out. After three and a half, we are still scoreless here in Cadillac. And we'll be back with more baseball here on the Northwoods Baseball Radio Network. This is the Reverend Ira Gay for the Buckstop Inn Community Theater. 
I hope you'll join me for their production of Our Town. The Buck Stop in Community Theater. Making things happen. And welcome back with us here in Foghorn Field. No score as we enter the fifth inning. And pitcher Todd Gonzalez will lead off against Brock Niedermeyer. And the pitch. That's high for ball one. The 1 0. And he pops that one up way up. Slauson is under it. And he makes the catch for out number one. One out. Nobody on for the top of the Tigers' order. Vaughn Kramer. Kramer had a base hit in the first inning. And the pitch. That's in there for strike one. Via one pitch. That misses the outside. It's one and one. The one one pitch. And that misses low for ball two. The two one. Swing and a miss, it's two and two. The two two pitch. That's fouled back and we'll do it again. The pitch. Inside for a ball. That almost hit Kramer. The payoff pitch. Fly ball. Left field. Parker going after it. And he has it for out number two. And that brings up Prudence Jefferson, hitless so far this evening. And the pitch. And that runs inside. Jefferson dances out of the way. The 1 0. Swing and a miss, it's 1 and 1. The 1 1 pitch. And that misses outside for ball two.
the 2-1. And that's hit sharply to short. Lawson has it and fires to first just in time to retire Jefferson to end the inning. Through four and a half, we are scoreless here at Foghorn Field. We'll be back with the bottom of the fifth here on the Northwoods Baseball Radio Network. Buck three, AV. Specializing in Betamax and Multivision DVD. The only such service in the Quint City area. Tim Buck three, AV. And welcome back with us here at beautiful Foghorn Field in Cadillac, Michigan. Wally McCarthy and producer Phil back with you. It is a scoreless game as we enter the bottom of the fifth. And Gabriel Palomar will step in to face Todd Gonzalez. And the pitch. That's in there for strike one. The 0 1. And that misses outside for a ball. It's 1 and 1. The 1-1, one, one. and that's in the dirt for ball two. The 2-1, two, and that's a bouncer to third. Sessions has it and fires across to first in time to retire Palomar for the first out. And that will bring up Philip Nakamura. And the pitch. That misses low for ball one. The 1-0. And that's chopped to the right side. Kramer has it and flips to first in time to retire Nakamura. Two outs, nobody on for Flipper Cortez. And the pitch. That's in there for strike one. The 0-1. Swing and a miss. It's 0-2. The 0-2. That misses outside. It's 1-2. The 1-2, and 
and he fouls that one off and will do it again. the pitch and that misses low count even at two and two the two two and that bounces in front of home plate full count The payoff pitch. And that misses high for ball four. And now a zany fan is on the field. Actually, that's what we used to call a streaker. Great day in the morning. Producer Phil, I haven't seen one of those since 1978. And the grounds crew is giving chase. Let's take a moment for a station ID here on the Northwoods Baseball Radio Network. You're drifting off. With WSLP AM, Big Rapids. All right. The grounds crew was kind enough to loan the fan a Cadillac car's bathrobe. And I think it's safe to say he'll be spending the night in the Cadillac cooler. Two out. Man on first for Giovanni Gasparro. He struck out in the third inning. And the pitch. And that's chopped back to Gonzalez. And he lost it to first in time to end the inning. After five innings, still scoreless here in Cadillac. We'll be back with the sixth inning here on the Northwoods Baseball Radio Network. date with all the shenanigans of the Sleep Baseball universe at sleepbaseball.com. The latest episodes, news from the Quint Cities, and fabulous items from the gift shop. Sign up for Wally's World, our infrequent and mildly entertaining newsletter. Find it all today at sleepbaseball.com. And we're back at Foghorn Field here in Cadillac, Michigan. Wally McCarthy and producer Phil reporting. No score as we enter the sixth inning. And Bruford Kosinski will bat for the Tigers to lead us off. He had a base hit in the third inning. And the pitch from Niedermeyer. That's a fly ball driven to left field. Parker is after it. And he makes the catch for out number one.
and Schmitty Diaz will step in. And the pitch. And that's in there for strike one. The 01. Swing and a miss, strike two. The 02 pitch. And he takes an awkward swing at that curveball for strike three. Two outs. Base is empty for Ernesto Stern. The pitch. That paints the corner for strike one. Via one. And that's a bouncer that squeaks through the infield. And that's a two-out single for Stern. And that will bring up Burt Sessions. The pitch. Swung on and missed, it's 0 and 1. VO 1. And that misses the outside for ball 1. The 1 1. That's inside for ball two. The two one. And that's called a strike, two and two. And now Gasparro's going to talk to Niedermeyer on the mound. And here's the 2-2 pitch. Right down the middle, and Session strikes out looking to end the inning. Still scoreless here at Falkhorn Field. We'll be back with more baseball here on the Northwoods Baseball Radio Network. tell you about my friends down at Glacier's End Farm. Derek and Libby. They're down in Williamson County in southern Illinois. And they make some outstanding small batch hot sauces, pickles, jams and butters, and miscellaneous shrub flavors. I used to think shrubs were bushes, and they are, but they're also sipping vinegars. They say sipping vinegars are good for your tummy. Anyway, stop on by their Facebook page and say hello. And you can search Glacier's End over there.
and tell them that Uncle Hat says hi. Thanks for listening. And welcome back, friends, to Foghorn Field here in Cadillac, Michigan. Wally McCarthy and producer Phil back with you. It is a perfect night for a ball game. No score as we begin the bottom of the sixth inning. And Brock Niedermeyer will step in to face Todd Gonzalez. And the pitch. And that misses the outside for ball one. The 1 0. And that's low for ball two. The 2-0. That's outside, and Gonzalez falls behind 3-0. And the 3-0 pitch. And that's in there for a called strike. It's 3-1. The 3-1, and that's flied to right. Kosinski has room, and he makes the catch for out number one. And Gabriel Palomar will step in at the top of the Cadillac order. He has struck out twice this evening. And the pitch. And that's lined to center. Diaz is camped under it. And he makes the catch for out number two. Two outs. Nobody on for Pinky Slauson. And the pitch. And that one is crushed to deep center. Diaz going back. And that's over the wall for a lazy solo home run. And Cadillac is on the board. And that breaks up the no-hitter for Gonzalez. And Fritz Ortega will step in. And the pitch. That misses low for ball one. The one out. That's in there for a called strike, one and one. The 1-1, one, one. down and in for ball two. The 2-1, two, and that's a bouncer back to Gonzalez. He picks it up and tosses to first in time to end the inning. Cadillac breaks the ice with Slauson's solo home run, and it's a 1-0 game.
We'll be back with more baseball here on the Northwoods Baseball Radio Network. And welcome back to Foghorn Field here in Cadillac, Michigan. As we begin the seventh inning, Cadillac leads 1-0, thanks to Pinky Slauson's solo home run in the bottom of the sixth. And catcher Clifton Santiago will lead off the Tigers' seventh against Brock Niedermeyer. Santiago bunted for a base hit in the second inning. And the pitch. And that's in there for a called strike, 0-1. The 1 pitch. That misses outside for ball one. The 1-1. One, one. That's low and inside. Ball two. And the 2-1. Inside again, and Niedermeyer falls behind 3-1. And, the 3-1. That's in there for strike two. Full count. The payoff pitch, and that's on the ground into shallow right. Palomar coming in, and he fires to first, just in time to retire Santiago for the first out. That was a sensational play by Gabriel Palomar. One out, nobody on for Sharky Bush.
And here's the pitch. And that's dribbled right back to Niedermeyer, who tosses to first in time for the second out. And that will bring up pitcher Todd Gonzalez. The pitch. That misses outside for ball one. The 1 0. Fouled off and out of play, it's 1 and 1. The 1 1 pitch. And that's a grounder right side. Easy play for Cortez, who shovels to first to get Gonzalez to end the inning. We'll be back with the bottom of the seventh in a moment here on the Northwoods Baseball Radio Network. This is Giovanni Gasparo. When I was a kid, we did all kinds of crazy things, like a stand on our heads and eat a cracker. Later, some of my friends had turned to their drugs, and all kinds of things happened to them. This has been Giovanni Gasparo with the PSK for WSLP. back here at Foghorn Field in Cadillac, Michigan. Bottom seventh, Cadillac leads 1-0. And Shiny Patterson will step in. And here's the pitch to Patterson. And Patterson gets all of that one. That one is crushed to deep left field. Still going back. And that's a leadoff solo home run by Shiny Patterson. And Cadillac now leads 2-0. No outs. One in. Bases empty for Gabriel Palomar. And the pitch. That's in there for a called strike. 0 and 1. The 0 1. And that misses outside for a ball. It's 1 and 1. The 1-1. One, one. That's fouled back and out of play. It's 1-2. and two. The 1-2. Two. 
swung on and missed for strike three. One out, nobody on for Philip Nakamura. And the pitch. That's in there for a called strike, 0-1. The 01, and that misses outside, it's one and one. The 1 1 pitch, and that's chopped to the right side. Kramer scoops it up and shovels to first in time for the second out. Two outs. Nobody on for Flipper Cortez. The pitch. Swung on and missed. It's 0-1. The 0-1. Fouled back and out of play, it's 0-2. The 0-2 pitch. And that's a swing and a miss to end the inning. Cadillac adds a run, and they now lead 2-0. We'll be back with the eighth inning here on the Northwoods Baseball Radio Network. Hey, kids. This is Blink Redderson. I'm here at Ted's Fishing World, and I just want to say they've got some great deals for people that like to fish or wish they could fish. They have reels, and they have lures, and they have bait. RLB, they call it. You're going to get the RLB special 25% off if you mention my name, Link Redderson. Ted's Fishing World. If fishing is in your head, trust Ted. Ted. Welcome back to Foghorn Field in beautiful Cadillac, Michigan. Wally McCarthy and producer Phil back with you as we begin the top of the eighth inning. Top of the order due up for Toma as Vaughn Kramer steps in. Brock Niedermeyer still on the mound, pitching a gem this evening. And the pitch. That's in there for a called strike, 0 and 1. The 0 1. When that misses outside, it's 1 and 1. The 1-1 one, one pitch, and that misses low for ball two. The 
the 2-1. Fouled off and out of play, two and two. The two two pitch swung on and missed for out number one. One out, nobody on for Prudence Jefferson. And the pitch. Swing and a miss, strike one. The 0 1. That's in there for strike two. The 0 2 pitch. And that's outside for ball one. The 1 2. And that's in the dirt for ball two. It's 2 and 2. And the 2 2. That misses low, full count. The payoff pitch. And that's belted to deep right field. Palomar hustling after it. And that will fall in for a base hit and roll into the corner. Prudence Jefferson will have a one-out double. And Bruford Kaczynski will step in. He had a single in the third inning. And the pitch. Fly ball, shallow right. Cortez gets under it. And he makes the catch for out number two. Two outs, runner on second for Schmitty Diaz. Diaz is 0 for 3 this evening. And the pitch. Swing and a miss for strike one. The 0 1. And that's grounded down the first base line. Nakamura has it and tosses to Niedermeyer to retire Diaz to end the inning. At the end of seven and a half, it's Cadillac two, Toma nothing. We'll be back with more baseball here on the Northwoods Baseball Radio Network. shenanigans of the Sleep Baseball universe at sleepbaseball.com. The latest episodes, news from the Quint Cities, and fabulous items from the gift shop. Sign up for Wally's World, our infrequent and mildly entertaining newsletter. Find it all today at sleepbaseball.com.
and welcome back with us at Foghorn Field. Cadillac leads 2-0 as we begin the bottom of the eighth. And Todd Gonzalez returns to the mound to face Giovanni Gasparro. And the pitch. And that misses low for ball one. The 1-0. And that's grounded up the middle and into center field. And Gasparo starts off the inning with a base hit. Runner on first. No outs for Brock Niedermeyer, who will apparently stay in to pitch the ninth inning. And the pitch. That's outside for ball one. The 1 0. And that paints the corner for a called strike, one and one. The 1 1 pitch. Swing and a miss, it's one and two. The one two. And that misses outside. Count even at two and two. And the pitch. And that smacked into the gap in center field for a base hit. Tigers manager Yugi Fukuda is going to head out to the mound. And it looks like we're going to have a pitching change for Toma here in the bottom of the eighth. Let's take a moment for a station ID here on the Northwoods Baseball Radio Network. You're drifting off with WSLP AM, Big Rapids. And welcome back with us. Cesar Nixon is the new hurler for the Toma Tigers, and he'll face Gilligan Parker at the top of the Cadillac order. Nixon has pitched five innings of work this season with an ERA of 1.80. Nobody out. Runners at first and second for Gilligan Parker. And the pitch. And that's in there for strike one. The 0-1. Swing and a miss on that outside curveball. Parker falls behind 0 and 2. And the 0 2 pitch. Swing and a miss for the first out of the inning. 
One down. Runners on first and second for Pinky Slauson. Slauson belted a solo home run in the sixth inning. And the pitch. And that's in there for a called strike. 0-1. The 0-1. That's low for ball one. The 1-1. Swung on and missed. It's 1-2. and two. And the one-two pitch. Tapped foul, and we'll do it again. And the pitch. Swing and a miss, and he is down on strikes for out number two. Two outs. Runners on first and second for Fritz Ortega. Ortega is 0 for 3 this evening. And the pitch. And that's outside for ball one. The 1 0. That misses low. It's 2 and 0. The 2 0. Swing and a miss. It's 2 and 1. The 2 1. Low and outside, and it's three and one. And the three one pitch. Swing and a miss, full count. The payoff pitch. And that's lined and caught by Stern at first to end the inning. And at the end of eight, it's Cadillac two, Toma nothing. We'll be back with more baseball here on the Northwoods Baseball Radio Network. for Mr. King's particles. We're the only one in the Quincy area with the helium. How else you want to put a balloon without a helium? That's what I say. Go over to Mr. King's particles. Tell him that Giovanni Gustavo sent it. What a lift. Mr. King's particles.
Wally McCarthy and producer Phil back with you at Foghorn Field in Cadillac, Michigan. As we begin the top of the ninth, Cadillac leads 2-0, and Ernesto Stern will step in to face Brock Niedermeyer, who has pitched eight shutout innings this evening. And the pitch. And that's in there for strike one. VO one. And that misses low, it's one and one. The one one pitch. And that's lined into center. And that's a leadoff single for Ernesto Stern. No outs, man on first for Burt Sessions. And the pitch. That's outside for ball one. The 1-0. -oh. Swing and a miss, it's one and one. The one one pitch. Outside for ball two, two and one. The two one pitch. And that's right down Main Street for a cold strike. It's two and two. The two two. And that misses low for ball three, full count. And the payoff pitch. Swing and a miss for strike three. One out, man on first for Clifton Santiago. Santiago has reached base twice tonight. And the pitch. That's outside for ball one. The 1-0. -oh. Fouled off, it's one and one. The 1-1 one -one pitch. Fouled off again, it's one and two. The one two. And that runs inside. Count even at two and two. The two two. And that's lined foul down the first baseline, and we'll do it again. And the 2-2. That's in the dirt, full count. The payoff pitch. And that's shoved foul and out of play, and we'll do it again.
the 3-2. And that's lined into right field. Stern is hustling to third. Santiago now trying to make second. And he will be in there safely. That's a one-out double for Clifton Santiago. Runners on second and third. One away for Sharky Bush. And the Toma Tigers threatening in the top of the ninth. And the pitch. That's low for ball one. The 1-0. -oh. That misses outside. It's 2-0. -oh. The 2-0 -oh pitch. High and inside. Ball three. The 3-0 pitch. And that's in there for a called strike. The 3-1 pitch. That's chopped up the middle. Slauson has it. And he throws to first in time to retire Sharky Bush. But Stern will score from third. And Santiago advances to third base. One in, one out. Man on third for pinch hitter Toots McGee. And the pitch. And that's in there for a called strike. 0-1. Oh The 0 1 pitch. Line foul down the first baseline. It's 0 and 2. The 0 2. That's high and outside for ball one. The one-two. Fouled off, just got a piece of it, and we'll do it again. And the pitch. And that misses inside. It's two and two. The 2-2. Two -two. And that misses outside. Full count. The payoff pitch. And that's lined softly into the gap in center field. And this game is now tied. Two outs, man on first for the top of the Tigers order, Vaughn Kramer. And the pitch. And that ball is crushed into left field, way back. And that's a two-run homer for Vaughn Kramer. And just like that, the Toma Tigers lead 4-2. to two. two outs, bases empty for Prudence Jefferson, who is hitless thus far this evening.
and the pitch. That's in there for strike one. The 1 That misses outside for ball one. The 1-1 one, one pitch. And that paints the corner for a called strike, one and two. The one-two pitch. And that's popped up to left center field. Ortega is under it. And he has it to end the inning. But the Toma Tigers strike back, and they now lead 4-2. to two. We'll be back with more baseball here on the Northwoods Baseball Radio Network. Back three, AV. Specializing in Betamax and multi regional DVD. The only such service in the Quint City area. Timbuk three, AV. Welcome back with us to Foghorn Field in Cadillac, Michigan. As we begin the bottom of the ninth, the Toma Tigers lead 4-2 after scoring four runs in the top of the ninth. And reliever Jimmy Shirley will be on the mound for the Tigers to face Shiny Patterson. Patterson belted a solo home run in the seventh inning. And the pitch. And that misses outside for ball one. The 1-0. Outside again, it's 2 0. And the 2 0 pitch. And that's low for ball three, and surely falls behind 3 0. And the 3-0 pitch. And that's inside, and Patterson draws a leadoff four-pitch walk. No outs. Runner on first for Gabriel Palomar. And the pitch. And that's in there for a called strike, 0-1. Oh the 0-1. And that misses outside for ball one. The 1-1. One, one. Swing and a miss for strike two.
the one two. And that's outside for ball two, count even at two and two. And the pitch. Swing and a miss, and Palomar strikes out for out number one. One on, one out for Philip Nakamura. And the pitch. And the runner goes. Throw to second base, not in time. And that's a stolen base for Patterson. And the 1 0 pitch. That's low and in for ball two. The 2 0. That's in there for a called strike. Two and one. And the two one pitch. And Nakamura gets all of that one. That's a long, lazy home run over the right field wall. And the Cadillac cars have tied the game in the bottom of the ninth. Base is cleared, game tied, and one out for Flipper Cortez, who represents the winning run. And the pitch. And that's outside for ball one. The 1 0. Swung on and missed. It's 1 and 1. The 1 1 pitch. And that's inside for ball two. The two one. Right down the middle for strike two. The two two pitch. And that's low, full count. The payoff pitch. Fouled back, and we'll do it again. And the pitch. And that's fly to center. And that one will drop in for a base hit. One out. Winning run at first for Giovanni Gasparro. And the pitch. That's in there for a called strike. 0 and 1. The 0 1. And that's called strike 2. The 0 2 pitch. Chopped foul, and we'll do it again. The O2. And that's going to be a no-doubter. 
way back and over the wall. That's a walk-off home run for Giovanni Gasparro. And the Cadillac cars have won the game in the bottom of the ninth inning by a score of 6-4. to four. For the visiting Toma Tigers, four runs on nine hits, no errors. For the Cadillac Cars, six runs on seven hits, no errors. We'll be back with the postgame show in a moment, here on the Northwoods Baseball Radio Network. <laughs> 